Hello everyone, and welcome back to Workers and Resources Soviet Republic, the Democratic People's Republic of Fjordland, and episode number 78 in the Let's Play series. Um, I'm coming to you here in a voiceover, uh, post-recording of what was a very, very long video recording session. Um, Things are in speeded up mode at the moment because if you remember at the end of the last video I said I was going to leave things running just to build stuff, right? Um, which is great, which is what I decided to do, but I can't just play the game and not do anything. So I ended up building, or planning rather, um, a whole new network of roads and rail. This is in preparation for the cultural capital city which is coming soon uh, in fact it as i say in the video that's you're about to watch uh, that's going to be the next episode we're going to make a plan of it anyway at least we're going to start the plan but in the first instance and what i'm doing here um oh god, god that's really fast probably maybe a little too fast it's fine it's like two hours of planning nonsense here um but i'm connecting us up with the nato countries which Controversial, I know. Connecting us up with those NATO, NATO bad boys. Um, but essentially, what this will do is uh, mean that we can trade with whichever NATO neighbour it is. Canonically, we've always said it's Finland, but Finland's not NATO, is it? So if it, fin Finland is traditionally neutral, um. <laughs> I'm, as as his as political life at the moment is teaching us, uh, so you know maybe maybe the, maybe it's Finland they act as proxy, or we can decide it's a different country. Your choice. Anyway, what this will do though is connect us up to those countries so that we can do some exporting. And I have a whole idea for building like a little. Um, I want to say distribution center, or maybe like an export zone, little zone on the border here uh, for that thing. It also means, though, that quite nicely, uh, you can get on the highway at Chernikova on the Soviet border and drive from there all the way to this border here through our nation, which I think is pretty cool. I think it's cool that we've now got, or we will now have, a highway and rail network that expand the length of the nation. I think that's pretty cool. Um, obviously, it's going to take a while to, to build all this nonsense. Um, and the main focus will be the cultural city. Which, um, a spoiler for the video after this one. I actually already started planning out. Um, because I'm, I've, I've done so much recording for this, these videos. That, apologies that there wasn't one last week. But it's mainly because um, this video required a little bit more editing than necessary. Not just because of this, but we had all kinds of problems with the greenhouses. Um, you'll see. I don't want to spoil it because I'd like you to watch the video. Uh, but it is something we solve. The greenhouses do get built. Um, the things to come. East Rayori is going to have people living in it. It's exciting. It's things are gradually coming together i do see and i think i mentioned this in the video to come as well i do see an end to fjordland right i do see an end i think once the cultural city is built that is going to be our kind of showpiece city and i think that that's a good place to maybe finish fjordland i'm i'm tentatively saying finish fjordland um mainly because i i thought while i was doing this i'm like right well when this is done God, when this cultural city is done, I think I'm done with Fjordland. But actually, I then started doing more stuff, and I really got excited by it. So we'll see. Maybe, who knows, who knows. Maybe what we could do is put Fjordland up for people to download with all the mods and everything. Um, and people can take it one step further. I don't know. Alternate reality Fjordlands. Oh my gosh, it, that could be cool. No, uh, talking nonsense. Either way, I still really love Fjordland, but we, we do have some exciting things in the works. Um, collaborative projects, maybe. Who knows? It's all very, very, very exciting. Um, as I say, though, first things first. Cultural City coming next episode. But in this episode, in this one today, uh, after I've done all this work with the highways, um, 
Dreori East is going to get finished. We're going to get people at the... What are they called? Those things? Those places? Greenhouses! Um, but first things first, uh, we need to get the power place set up. Um, which is another thing, which takes a little bit of time. But you'll see. You'll see. Um, I'm going to leave you in a minute for past Chris who I recorded a few days ago and I'm recording this several days later. Enjoy! Right then. Here we go. Hopefully, future Chris, who's done the narration, has done a good job of explaining what has happened in these six months that have passed, but here we are. Here we are, people. The greenhouses are done. The only thing we're waiting on now is this little power plant to get done, and that's not going to take too long to go but this area is looking nice i had a bit of fun decorating it and, and making it cool with these done then what do they need they need chemicals and they need crops no no they need coal and chemicals we've got the coal coming over here and when power comes out that'll make everything work nicely we have a chemical plant over here which incidentally needs oil and crop so we're in a bit of a chicken and an egg situation where one one can't work without the other. And they all need power. So, I'm thinking what I want to do, what I really want to do is I think I want to ha 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 when it comes time, we may buy some here. Like, yeah, so so let me just... Oh, I don't want to put you on too fast forward. Just want to work it out. So we need chemicals, and chemicals are going to get stored in here. And we need crops as well, and crops are going to get stored in here. We have this distribution office right now, which we are going to use to purchase some vehicles. Uh, and we need covered hulls to carry chemicals and crops. Now, we have some very fast ones. Oh, you're new. You are new. Are you fast? It is relatively fast. I always like it when new lorries come along. Let's make you... Oh, we got some lovely colours. I do like that blue there. I'm going to make... We're going to have loads of you. Yeah, come along. Loads of you. Bloody loads of you. Look at that. Awesome. Awesome. Now, these greenhouses will make crops. And the crops are great. But what I have realised is that... The reason we built this was so that we could then feed these people here. And guess what? Guess what, people? Well, we haven't built a bloody food factory, have we? Um, so that is something we are going to need to do soon. But let's just pause and work this out. The the um, oil thing is working now. We're storing a lot of oil. So we do need food. We do need a food place here. This is linked up to the train line. So, it might be... I mean, it's very complicated down here. A lot of... A lot of <laughs> complicated train things. I'd like a food factory, right? And I'd like to get people here working at the food factory. But I would also like to not overcomplicate my rail network, right? Ideally, that would be... That would be super. So, maybe... The ra rail comes out this way... Hmm, where could we build one? Because it would be great to just... What I should have done is built one here. What do, what do you have? What do we have? Let's have a look. Let's have... Let's... I'll tell you one. We'll turn that auto building off first. And let's have a look at what type of food factories we have. You make 31 tons in this tiny... Oh, you're awesome. You would have been awesome. It's a shame I've messed up with the rails. Because having, having a little food factory like you... How much can you store? You use 65 tons of crops. And you employ 260 people. Is that the one we've got over in Nickachop? Come with me. Fly. Fly with me. Fly. Nickachop. I think it might be the same one. I'm not sure. Have a look. Food. Hello. Yeah, it's the same one. It's the same type of food factory. Okay, so we know you're successful in Nickachop. We know we've got... Um, another one somewhere we have obviously ha obviously we have the default one we have this one as well which is pretty cool lots of connections on you you produce less food but you have bigger storage it's 
crops and food. Ha 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 ha. Ha. Interesting. And we also have... Holy cow, we have the grapevine. <laughs> Do you only work... Yeah, you only work in summer. I love these vineyards because they produce food just straight away. It's so stupid. There is a greenhouse, I think, that does that. But we want to convert this into food. Okay, come over. Let's come over here. Another thing that built, right? I put this statue up on this hill, which... What a view. What a view, people. Oh. This is one of my models, by the way. Not that I modelled it. I, 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 I cannot take credit for the model itself. I converted it to City Skylines. No, that's, that, we're not playing City Skylines. What is the game we're playing? Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. I did put this little hammer and sickle on it, though, on the texture, because that wasn't on it. Um, it's a good model. It's a good model. Uh, anyway, sorry. Um, food, food, food. So we do need a little food factory. I think we'll go with, for variation, we'll go with this one. Just for a laugh. Where are we going to put it then? Because what we could do with is... I'd really like a little shunter train that just shunts things back and forth. But I don't think we're going to be able to do that. Short of making an overly complicated rail system. Which I don't want to do. Although we could... No, if I put it here, right. Listen, if I put it here with a little connection. The train... We could get a tiny train to go backwards and forwards and shuffle things along. <laughs> that would be stupid, wouldn't it? It would be stupid. It would be really stupid. He says, thinking about it. Well, you could. Comes down here. Train comes down. It could. We could get it to go off here. And then break down. Oh, man, no. That's too, too complicated. Too complicated for what I want to do. I, I, I mean, it isn't. We could easily get that to work. But it's just crops are going to go here. We want those crops for, I don't want to, uh, we could just deliver the crops by, by distribution lorry, which is what these are. But what I want is, I want, if we use the distribution lorries, they'll deliver straight from field to there rather than there. And I want the crops to go into this central place. So that then a food lorry can... Mm, unless... <laughs> unless so, so, hear me out. Unless we have a food factory based down here. Here's an idea. Here's an idea. Do you have connections? You have connections. What if... What if we... Can you do this? Why won't you work? Let's just see. Just for... Right. Let's say we built you there. What about factory connections? Where's my factory connections these days? Where are they? There, right. Here. Is this going to work? Okay, so that works. So, what if we do that? What if this, this here literally just supplies a food factory here? And then the food factory, we have a little storage off it. That kind of works for me, you know? That kind of works. Could we could we potentially even get the bus station to... Right. Come down here. Can you get under here? Like, if I wanted this to come up here... And then around to there do you think i wonder i wonder i do wonder let's um let us let's just you and me do this really quickly i also want um i want i want everything else to be built right so 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 bus stop here oh, i have a horrible feeling the food factory is just out of reach you know just out of reach, maybe. Hmm. If needs be, we could always get a bus that, that goes to it. Which would be a pain, but I'm gonna build this as well. I know it's I know, it's cheeky. We'll get we'll get the uh, construction people to come and do a job there though. Um right. 
because I do think it should be here. If we have to get a second bus going here, then so be it. Like, I'm I'm fine with that. Let's let's get a storage up, and then let's get a um a doobity dar up. You know what I mean. You know you do know what I mean. A, a, a cargo station. Oh boys. Right. What about you? Can you? I want. I want. What I really really want is a better storage facility than that. I want one that can store plenty of food. What are you like? You're decent. You're going to be able to do what I want. So if I put you back here, right, we then get a little, a little cargo station, a little one. Come on. What are you? You're not what I want. Give me what I want. What's this medium cargo station? Holy cow, that's for an airport. We've used this one before. But it doesn't quite. I just, I just want a, I just want a cargo station, one that, that does two vehicles. What does the default one do? Tell me that. Default cargo station, road cargo station. Four vehicles. One's smaller than the other for some reason. What's what? Okay, that's bizarre. I just. Well, uh, what's up with this one? Oh, okay. Okay, that's pretty cool. Is you a one way in, one way out one? I think that one's one way in, one way out. Maybe. I'm not sure. Let's build it here. See what happens. Because what I'd like to do as well, whilst whilst we're having a bit of a, a thing, we'll build a road. No, in fact, we'll make it dirt so that the people can can do it build that there that goes to there I hope this is the one-way one actually and we'll put this there and across like that and I don't know if that's I don't know how that's gonna work if honest but we'll find out won't we you and I together I just think that'll be really good because then Food goes straight into here. We don't need anything else for the food factory. I hope not. Anyway, if I do, I've made a right pig's ear of it, babies. Um, no. We just need crops. Just need the crops. This can provide the crops. These here can... They can... i tell you what they can do. They can go here. And they can go here. And they can go here. And what they can do at both places... They can, they can load everything. So in one place, what I need them to do at this cargo station here. Oh my god, right. This is going to be so confusing. Right. So, from the greenhouses, they need to load, load crops. They need to unload chemicals. They need to load crops. They need to unload chemicals. And when they come to the road place, the, the yeah, this ter cargo terminal, they need to unload crops, but load chemicals. <laughs> I hope that makes sense. That should make sense, right? We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens, you know? I hope that it works out for them. I really do, because it's confused my brain. It really has. No, I think that'll work. I think that'll work. I'm, I'm getting myself all, all in a in, in a tiz about it. Right. Well, we'll leave that to work. That'll hopefully work soon. In terms of over here, then I do want to get people working over here. And I'll be honest, until that food factory's up and running, what's what's your problem, brother? You seem to be lost. Oh, have you just gone a bit wrong? He's gone a bit wrong. They don't know what they do. Oh, hang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, you can... Surely you can come back out this way. You can come back out, can't you? What are they struggling with there? I'm well confused. It's all... 
Why can't they do it? <laughs> what are they missing? What's going on? Why can't they get out? That's... That doesn't make any sense. I don't understand what their problem is. Huh. 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 I don't know. I really don't know. I'm gonna... Um... Okay. We'll just build that then, I guess. I don't have the patience to find out. So we do have that there. Um, when we get power... Yes, yeah, so what I was saying. What was I saying? Um, I think we may need to... Where is my shop? Hello, shop. I think I'm going to be naughty for a minute, right? And what I want in here is... Um, food and clothing and electronics. And as much as I, I do want all this stuff to be our own, can I? I wish there was a way to copy warehouse stuff. There probably is. You're probably saying, well, well you're in luck, Christopher, because there is. Um, but I don't know it. Am I, do I assign these to the same distribution bad boys as, as these? Uh, I, I guess we could. If I put you there... And you there as well. What do you do? You take clothes and electronics, which is nice. And then um, we'll also assign you, you, and you, and you. And at those shops, if it will let me, all I want you to take to the departments is meat. Meat, please. Traore East. No, I want you to unload. Darlings, unload. Yeah, yeah. I thought that's... I thought... You know what? I thought you were having trouble. But you're fine. You're fine with it, aren't you? We got a lot... We got a lot of meat. To be fair, we got a lot of food as well. I just think the other food factory will help. What is your problem, brother? Oh, do you know what? I think I've messed this up. But I don't know how. So we're just gonna... We're just gonna... Yeah, you can do it this way then. See if I care. See if I care, mate. And I've not done it right, though, have I? We'll just buy it all. All right. Well, that solves that problem, doesn't it? What was their problem? What were they? What were they struggling with there? I, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, you. There we go. Right. Okay. So I don't know what its problem was there. I really, really don't. I'm I'm really confused as to what the problem is. I probably should have put like another little thingy in. Alright, well, they come along here. I hope this is one way. I really hope this is one way. I, I guess what we need to do is work out which way in and which way out. Although it does need power. Of course it needs power. Are you going to get... Have you got power nearby? Uh, that's a problem, isn't it? There is no power nearby. So we do need another flipping power supply which is irritating but is not the end of the world do we not have a substation oh, that's a that's a past we will just auto build this because i'm just done i am done with you um and i guess it makes sense to have one out here because we are going to need power eventually like probably out this way so we'll put it we'll put it here we will get a cable hello thank you We'll go down here. We'll follow the road for a moment. We will get stuck. No, we won't. We'll be okay, actually. We'll go this way, though. We'll go... I, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, 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 hello. Yes, I remember. Where are you? Ah, uh, aha. More power issues I see so we'll come down here and connect to there and it'll be a real mess but hopefully that will mean that one day we get power down here and then what are we do yeah well we've done this we're making food down here 
food is going to be great. And then what's the what's the plan? We we deliver this food down to down to the city as well. When we get food in here, brothers and sisters. When the food gets here, what are you? You're dropping off food. It's not what I wanted, mate. I wanted you to drop it there. That's what I wanted. I feel like... I feel like you're not taking this seriously, friends. Unload. I just want them to unload me. Right? Uh, it, I mean, it's getting there. I'm not going to complain. It's getting there, isn't it? What do we need here? We do need power. Okay, so we need this to fit. Okay, of course, of course. Before we can move people in, we need power. What I was also thinking of, and you can look look over here. Look at all the nonsense, all the steel that has been made in Dreori. Absolutely huge. So, I did start building <laughs> a dock, um, which is crazy. I know. Uh, the dock idea being that we will be able to drop some steel and bricks and prefab panels here. And then we're going to ship them off. Maybe to NATO. Maybe to the Soviets. But it's a nice river path that allows us to do so. So I'm hoping that boats can access this. Um, it has got a little roundabout that apparently is finished. So we'll, we'll do this. We'll call this the... We'll call this Dreori Docks. Dreori Docks there, look. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. We'll, uh, we'll upgrade these paths as well. We'll get the highway agency working on that straight away. And then, yeah, all this is going to get built eventually. There's just a lot of construction going on. Obviously, we have this to focus on, and that will be the focus maybe of the next episode. It may be another speedy build as I plan out a city layout, but basically, micro district after micro district here, people. We're going to have the train line come here. I've built it with enough space that we can potentially utilize this area for storage or something. I don't know how we'll get, we'll, but we'll need to get food across here. I think rather than having rather than having food go over via the bridge, we might be better to have it go in via trains. And having it along this path here, we could always open this stock. We could open this storage up to food eventually. We could do that. Maybe I'll do that now. Let me allocate for that amount. 300 tons of food, right? This theoretically will never stop producing food. So if we can get a food train here that just goes backwards and forwards to the cultural city, then we may be okay. We may be okay. How long have you got left, brothers? Not too long. Too long. We've got a load of new vehicles, though. That's exciting, isn't it? Um, oh, my God. Everything stopped producing. What What stopped producing? Anderstock? The heck, Anderstock? You were, you're were all reliable. Look at all the Fjordskas. I don't know. Oh, I'm just going to test something. So, this is on the standard Fjordska blue colour, right? We have that one. Yeah. Yeah. Yes! I did make the beautiful, bright coloured ones. Oh, that's cool. Did I put the them over anywhere? Have I ever built the bright coloured ones? No. All oh, these have gone back to their normal skin. I'm pretty sure Julia Stock used to have, like, the red, white, and blue ones. I'm sure it did. Well, look, we're gonna give we're gonna we're gonna give them a coat of paint here in Julia Stock. You can have a white one. Uh, a yellow one. They're ugly. They're, I mean, they're not ugly. They're wonderful. Shut up. A, a, a blue one. Uh, we'll just do that for now. I quite like. I quite like the Fjordskas still. Maybe the cultural city will have lots of Fjordskas, or maybe it'll have something bigger. I do like Fjordskas though, and I imagine as a showpiece capital city. That was what the Fjordska was made for, right? It was made for large production. Like, how many people live in this? 320. We can even things out. We can make these lovely little districts. It can be like Gavusk, except Gavusk did not use the Fjordskas. 
Gavisk used, I mean, don't get me wrong, they're similar designs. But I think if we can make out some districts, hot, I mean, there'll be loads of districts. It'll be great. It'll be wonderful. Right, we just need the power. We just need the power now. Power to come in. And then let's, I'm going to fast forward. We need the power to, oh, we need concrete people. Come on. Who's building this? I feel like I want to take all of you off. How can I, how do I um, remove you all? Just like this. I want to remove you all, okay? Save. No, go, go away. Go away. Right, I don't want any of the, I don't want district, the ones from far away doing it. I just want the new guys. Just want the new guys doing it. I just want my new guys to come and do a job for us, okay? Because I feel like they're the closest by, and they'll be the ones who can help us in whatever it is we're doing here. And, and once that's done, then I want us to, I want us to get Traore East up and running. I want people to work here we do need to think about transport we haven't really thought about transport yet we've got the we've got the bus here central bus station which will pick up workers and will take the workers down here i don't really understand the new traffic update i've got to be honest we've got waiting stations and i don't really know what a waiting station is what is this what is its purpose is it for a bus to wait why why does it do that What's the point? Someone explain, or, or, or link me to a good traffic tutorial, please. Because I also don't get, where is it? And I'm not on the advanced set. I want to say, I've not put advanced traffic on as of yet. I might do. We're not putting water on. Water's not happening. But advanced traffic, I don't feel the need for it as of yet. But this thing here, right? Place this at the entry to a town. How does that work? Because like in my head, let's put it here, Dreori East, right? But you come down to it and it says, where's it gone? Oh no, my sign. Here it says, cannot define correctly. So why is that? Someone, if someone can tell me in the comments below, it'd be just nice, wouldn't it really? It would just be nice. Right, if we can get buses going backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards there. We've also got that being made for some reason. A nice little uh, big wheel. But if we can get buses going down, what type of buses do we want? Where is my... here. No, I don't want to pause. I want to keep going. Right, what buses do we have? Do we have any new buses that are awesome? Well, we do have the... We still have the, the very slow but wonderful looking buses. That oh, I mean, these are good, aren't they? How many people work at a... Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go do, we're gonna go bendy buses, guys. We're going bendy buses. Uh, we will buy a fleet, a lovely fleet of buses, six in total, and then we're gonna create a route, and that route is gonna be called the Dreori East to no, oh my god, I can't type Dreori East Industrial route god help us everyone okay so the Dreori east industrial route is gonna come there and it's gonna ditch there okay so that's what that does with that being said can they now reach they can't reach the food factory so we are gonna need to build the food factory would it be worth putting in a bus station down here, right? A little one, so that then, if we build anything else up here, all we need to do is just increase bus capacity. I think it would be worth that. Thank you for thank you for agreeing with me, friends. Um, let's build a little bus stop, please. Bus stop. Now I want a um a little a small bus platform. That's all I want. Thank you. Um, where can it go? Oh. I just want a bus platform. We'll build it. Oh, 
be awesome. I just what we want, we want it here, really, don't we? Bus can come. Yeah, we'll do this here. Oh, you're not going to work, are you? Yes. Make me sick. <laughs> right, what if I can make you come here, there, like so. Yeah, build it. Build it. Make it happen. Make us dream. Make us dream, mate. So this comes here. Pausing it for a brief second so I can plan this out. We have a road crossing that goes like so. Build that. And then the buses in this route can come down here. One way. No? What do you mean you can't do... One ray roads cannot end in a building. Well, maybe it will just force them out that way. Maybe that will force them out that way. And, and they'll... I guess we'll work it out, won't we, when it happens. Uh, we will call this route... Nope. Hello. We'll call this one Dreori East. Oh, I've dropped a pen. Food. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, that's gone flying. I'll fix that in a minute when we finish up this video. Okay, cool. So we've got some stuff going like that. Where is my buses? There they are. Okay. So we'll we'll assign. Well, we need, let's go, four on the other. So, custom lines. Dreori East Industrial. Hello, you're cool. Set line vehicles. We'll go one, two, three, four. Right, on that line. And then on Dreori... I can't speak. Dreori East. Food. That was really bad. Dreori East Food doesn't have any lines, so we can't set any vehicles on it yet. But you'll go here as well. And then you will drop off down there. And then the vehicles that you will have in your system will be these two. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. I assume that that will work. This links up to everything there. So it's, yep. Chemical factory... The two places. And does everyone here, can everyone here, even you, the furthest away, you can get to the bus stop. Awesome. Awesome. We may need to sort some local stopping lines out in here. We may need to. But, hopefully, hopefully, it shouldn't take us, it shouldn't be that big an issue, you know? Hopefully, anyway. I can't believe I got my pen. My tablet pen as well. It's really annoying. Cool, 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 cool. Well, I'll tell you something. Let's, whilst this is building, let's have a think about Cultural City then. I'm wanting this to be... This is where we're going to show off our model building, okay? We've got our, our main throughway down here. We're going to have roundabouts. I want to build... Um, what is it? The big, big sport... It's not a playground, is it? I want this. I want to build this thing somewhere maybe on the coast we're gonna have tv i want a tv tower uh, i want yeah i mean i want this stadium the stadium is going to be like a massive showpiece we'll build the stadium like the stadium can go like here okay we'll build like roads leading to it or something oh we've got another new vehicle that's nice um, so the stadium is going to be there. We're going to have... Um, I want, what's, the, what's the radio network of that called? Broadcasting. Yeah, there. There we go. Uh, we're not going to go with the Berlin t TV tower because that's um, huge. But we will get this. This tower can be here. We've got a radio station. We've got school of ballet which i want to use we've got a press office there's all this stuff i know it's all jobs that we that we're just going to double up on but i don't really care we will get maybe down here in the, in the industrial land right i think if we can start shifting some plastics and stuff down here maybe this is a good place to finally build 
a car production facility. I know the cultural city is just that, it's a cultural city, but we're the land of the worker, and we want to still keep that route, and we're going to have a lot of people living here, and I do kind of think it might be good to do that. It might also be good to get trams, trams running down here as well. Uh, maybe, I don't know. Are you not done yet? Jesus Christ, dude. It's taking a very long time to fix and to finish. But I really want it to finish. But I suppose when it does finish, getting all these, turning the switch off and getting people to live here is going to be interesting. How are we looking for food? You've got loads of meat and just no clothes. Where are the clothes? Brothers, have we not got clothes? we got plenty of clothes. So why are you not picking up clothes, mate? That's interesting. Oh, okay. That's that's why. Because I'm stupid. Because I'm stupid, okay? That's why. Bloody hell. Right, now they're going to go get the clothes, are they? Bloody hell. Off they go. Doing their jobs. Absolute... Stupid man, me. Sometimes, sometimes I wonder why, why we, why we bother. Full of oil now. Yeah, I, I have no idea how much oil all this is going to use. I'm very excited to see. Can I just pay for you? It feels a bit cheaty after we have built everything up ourselves to just finish it. But got a lot of coal. I'm running out of time, and I want to get it done. Some things just take forever. Well, we're getting this done now, at least. Um, yeah, you're coming in here. You're going to deliver some clothes. You're going to deliver some food. Have we got loads of food? Yeah, we're pretty full. Pretty full on food. So that's decent. And we'll shouldn't be we, when we get the food factory down here working, we shouldn't have too much of an issue. What are you doing? Oh, you're going and de you're delivering the people to go and go and make it, aren't you? I wonder how long that will take. It's taking a... I think that's a few minutes to go. Let's, let's... It'll be done in a minute. It will be done. What about then... Um, so we, we're, we're building a dock. The dock is going to be built and that is for us to export some of our basic supplies. What about for the time being setting up... Because I'll tell you where I've not took you in a while. Let me tell you, look, oh, look at all the trees growing up around here. We've not gone to the border, so come with me. Now, when the update hit, the water uh, update, it broke the the, the borders. The, I had the queues all the way back down here, and I sent a panicked message to Mr. Aliki, well, and, on his Discord, saying, oh, I don't know what's happening. Reinstalled it. It does mean that these checkpoints will not have water, but seeing as we're not playing with water, that's fine. That is fine. And as well, we've had a lot of fun. Mr. Kachib, I've been chatting with about maybe in the future making a more in-depth, a, a different video. Fjordland, I think. I think what I want to do with Fjordland is I want to finish the cultural city. And I think once that cultural city's done, that may be a good place for, for Fjordland to, to finish, right? Just at that point. It's, it's, it's kind of, that's going to be our showpiece piece. We'll see how we feel when we get there. Because don't get me wrong, I still love this save. And I don't know if I'd get the same attachment to another save. But, but I mean, this, look. this this Our export business is doing doing wonderful. If we didn't... If I wasn't such a, a cheeky man and auto-built stuff, I think we would be mega rich. Because we've been around 42 million for a while now. And look at this. Jesus, we got loads of stuff here. Kind of makes me want to build something down here just to get it used. Have we got any monuments they can build or something? What's the biggest monument you guys can build? We can build the arc, the Triumph Arc. Well, we got the Friendship Arc, so... What can you build me that's massive? We've got some huge flipping towers... We've got the Pantheon. <laughs> no, that's silly. That is silly. Build me something, though. I want... You guys in the construction down here have not done anything for ages. What we got? You're a small one. Small. Large hands. These... 
This thing looks interesting. What do you take? Steel and concrete. Yeah, build me that. Where can we build it? Where's it going to look good? Should we just build it on the side of the motorway? Do you have any loyalty? You do. 500 meters. That's interesting. We could build... Oh, where's it going to look good? If we build some... I want to... Oh, we'll build it here. Is this a little hill? Sorry. Overlooking the, the steel works? Yeah, why not? We'll, we'll, yeah, why not? Let's get some some stuff built. I love this angled stuff, by the way. The the road angle stuff is great. Uh, yeah, Gavusk. This one here. You, all of you, come. Come and build me something. That's what I want. I want you to build. Build me everything. We've, we've already got Partizan Pass. Um, I just want more things. I feel like this is this whole construction industry down here just needs to be working. What can you build? What can you build for me? There must be something down here that we need. No, everything's looking decent. If I'm honest, we'll maybe assess this later on. Are the fields? Oh, they've already been harvested. How much crops have we got left? Oh, not as much as I want. Which is why it's important to get another harvester going. Plenty in here, which means they are still creating plenty of food. We should be, we should be doing okay food-wise. Have you finished this bloody thing yet? Nearly, nearly. Oh yeah, I give it a minute and it'll be done. A minute? What do we think? No, a few minutes. There's more than sixty seconds there needed. Three minutes to do it. Three minutes to go. That was a bit of quick maths there. We've all, we've got loads of stuff going on. Like, what else did I? What else are we building here? What did I ask him to build? I don't even know. We've got the docks. The docks is cool. So you're all built. You're taking some time. Once the power station's built, though, that'll be wonderful again let's let's build some more monuments let's just get monuments everywhere people we don't i tell you we don't have we don't have a lot of lenin we don't have a lot of lenin and, and that's mainly because we want more lenin we want bigger lenins but perhaps we could get a little red star here to represent our friends the worker and their yeah okay yeah I could do that. Let's go with Gavusk. You guys, come and build me this. We're gonna we're setting up a program of of a program of national monuments. Do you have any monuments here? No, you have a you have this. You do have a fountain, but you don't have a red star, do you? So maybe we'll build you one. And the stock, you love it, mate. And the stock, you bloody, you love it. Awesome, awesome. So that we're getting some jobs. We're just, we're just getting jobs for the people. Jobs for the people. <clears throat> okay, I've skipped ahead a little bit of time. Well, I say that I've, I've not recorded some because we're nearly there. Look, it's nearly done. Nearly done. You didn't need to sit and watch a thousand hours of it power plant being built but we're nearly there now it's going to be a matter of seconds a matter of seconds not many not many even they've got everything they need they have the workers it's going to be done in a second once this is done that will essentially mean power can kick in we can get people running over here and we'll, we'll get the cities living right that's what we'll do get ready get ready 10 9 8 so it's like the Millennium Countdown. Six. Five. Grab a hold of your partner. Three. Two. One. Happy New Year. Wait, what? What? Wait, what? What? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what? Where? What? <laughs> Stop. 
Does that mean that if I press this, it would actually give me money <laughs> for finishing this thing? <laughs> Does that seem crazy? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> there we go, it's done. It's done and there's already one crime here. That's great. Right, pause. Pause the game. Everything is here now. Here is what we need to do. So, we need people to come and work here. Everything is now set up and ready to go. How do we do this? How? We want to get people living here. Some goods are too few. Is that right? Well, it's just because... We don't have people in the shop yet. Some goods selling this shop are missing. I think I think they'll be fine. They're right there, right? It just needs the people to come and get them. I hope. Is it the same over here? Yeah. They're in there, though. They do have clothes, and they do have electronics in there. And are you still out delivering stuff? Or you deliver the food? Like, you tell me... I want, I, I want it more than 30%. I want it at least 70%, please. I'll go 60% on, on, on clothes, because... Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I, I, I want you guys to be out and about all the time, please. Let's see what that does. Yeah, they're all off out. Right, here we go then. Here we go. So... This place currently doesn't have power. Or does it? Wait a minute. Maybe it does have power. How are you getting power? Potential problem, but you've got power? You don't have power. We should we should be okay for power, simply because the lads... Um, <laughs> the lads? The power, there's multiple power connections here, so we've got to show you. We have one here. We have one in the middle of town. I believe we've got one over here as well. Same goes for heating. We've got heating here. Heating there. I made this one and I didn't quite realise how high I'd made the pipes. And now they look bloody stupid. But I kind of dig it. So. Here we go. Where's my buses? We're gonna... All of you. You're gonna go on a journey now. A journey through space and time. They're going to go and do their job. Off they go. They're going to go get some workers. And we can now officially say, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dreori East. And watch. Watch this. Watch this. Watch nothing happen. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening, people. We've allowed people to move in. But no one's moving in. <laughs> Please move in our new new area let's let's boost up the speed here we go here they go look here they all come flocking flocking from across the nation the people of Dreori East now come to live now ah see see it's pulled through it's pulled through the clothes straight away that's awesome now we do have it here only workers should come and stop here so that's great what we will do we will work out in the initial phase, we will work out what's happening here, who's coming over, what people are missing, and then in that instant, if we need to get transport out to the universities down here, we'll sort out buses and all that type of stuff. But, for the meantime, we should have people going and working here at the fire station. We should have plenty of people. The population of Dreori East is growing massively. And what we should get soon is buses. Here they come. Coming to... No, are you the right ones? Where do you take people? Yes. So you're going to... These buses... In fact, let's follow this bus on its maiden journey. We've got a lot of unemployed, but that is to be expected. We've got a lot of cars as well. We, I might put some more cars down here, you know? Could be fun. Here we go then. So... The first bus comes along past these tall tower blocks, and it looks beautiful. Dreori East is a wonderful place to live. Um, goes, cuts the corner. Can't be bothered with that corner, can it? No, no, no. Comes down here. Ah, I've, I've, I've not, 
I've not put a crossroads there, have I? So it's going to have to come down and cut itself around. <laughs> okay. That's fine. Watch it do a jackknife now. Ready? Oh, oh, that is, that is not, that is not healthy for a bus. Not healthy at all. But it is going to come in here now, and if we should see, yes, I know we have electricity problems. Don't worry, babes. Fill up on passengers. Yeah, everyone should come and work down this way. Now, what I'm thinking we may need to do once we get people down here is we may need to just purchase a little bit of um, grain for the chemicals and a little bit of chemicals for the greenhouses. And then that should see us through. Oh, look, we've got no workers here. Why have we not got workers there? Can they not get there? We will come and look at you in a minute because we do... Oh, no, we got a few. It may be one that evens itself out. Right, here we go then. The first workers on shift coming down to this place here. That was a dodgy corner again. We stop. Let's slow down the time. Here they go. They're all off to do their own stuff. Some are going to the warehouse. Look at them. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. Off they go. All the people to go do their thing. We drop all the people off. Right, let's watch what we need to do now. So we've got some people. Power is now booming here, which means this place should work momentarily. Don't tell me you've not got a power supply. You do have a bloody power supply, mate. What do you mean you don't have a power supply? I don't know what it means. Of course it has a power supply. I've got a literal, a literal box right here, mate. You're talking... Does it need a power supply? Let's, let's just te let's test some out really quickly. We've got coal. We've got that. Let's just purchase a bit of bit of chemicals. See what happens here. Are oh, you going to start doing a job? No. Why is there no power supply? Ha ha ha. Have I missed something? Most likely. Do you have a power? No. Oh no. What have I missed here then? What am I missing? Building doesn't have power. I think you'll find it does. Huh. Huh. That's problematic, isn't it? Why would that not work then? Because power is working elsewhere. You're saying you've not got power. I don't believe that either. You do have power. Do you need power? You've got power. Huh. Right, give me a minute. I'm going to Google this. Well, that took a while. <laughs> that took a while. This video is going to be great fun to edit. Blinking act. No, none of this just putting, putting audio over it and putting it on YouTube, eh, for me. No, 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 lots of editing. We fixed the problem, um, and I've left messages everywhere on Discord, but i tell you what I did. Um, I went into the building's code, the little script that you get with the video, um, and deleted the power consumption. It still needs power. It still does need power, I think. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. E either way, it's working now. It's producing a small amount of crop. And look, things are things are happening. Things are things are blinking happening. I'll tell you what else happened. These guys, a bus came down here to this bus stop here, right? And then didn't get back on the road. I had to build a little connecting road to go all the way through. So that was stupid. Um, but look, it's all gradually coming together. We have people here at the crop factory, not crop, the chemical factory. How many do you need? You need more chemicals. If I now stop you making chemicals, I mean making, not making chemicals, having crops, what will that do? Because how fast do you make crops? Uh, you're not the fastest, are you? I imagine we more people come in here. Look, here comes the next bus. We're, we're going to, yeah, yeah, look, look at all. 
and maybe the buses should spread out a little more. But it'll be fine. We've got stuff. We've got stuff working down here now, which is awesome. And a new type of vehicle is ready. So here we have it then. Dreori East. Dreori East. Where all the people come to feast. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. That was awful. That was awful. Um, car parks then. I mean, I, mean, I kind of want to give them more car parks. Do we have... Where's everyone gone? Did we did we purchase an entire block full of car parks here? Car parks? Cars. Dunno. Dunno what we did. Who knows what we did. Should we buy some more? What is the fastest car? I dunno, but I kinda like... What's my favourite? I mean, I love these. They're so slow. But I kinda love them. Uh, let's go. We'll go with these ones. We'll just buy some more red things. And some and some green and other ones and then people can come and they can they can enjoy life can't they I do think what we should probably do is connect these cars let's connect this up here right just like that awesome yeah and let's put another monument in uh, let's put Lenin in let's give them little Lenin overlooking a car park what do we think? A little Lenin here. We'll make it a little one. Not even. It doesn't even need to be the big one. A little Lenin park. Right there. Oh, they'll love that. They'll love that, won't they? The, the people. People who live and work here. We'll get the... We'll get the, the people to come and do this. Oh, yeah, because they can't come through here. They can't get to the car park. Oh, that's... We need, we need more paths. We need to connect everything up. Oh, honestly, I've gone a little bit mad now with all the nonsense. Um, come on. Why don't you go there like that? That would, that'll do. And we'll get the bad boys of the highway patrol to do stuff there as well. Let's up the government loyalty here. And are people going and doing a job here? Yes. We finally have people working at the orphanage. We have people going to university. This is great. I wanted this. We've got secret police. I reckon the police station's a little bit too far. Outer interest. I think I downloaded an interesting police station. What have we got? I mean, this thing is pretty cool. But I think I had a small... Small... No. It was like this. This stationary... Look at this thing. Look at this thing. A little stationary G... I A I unit. So I mean, we've got plenty of cool police stations to build these days, but I like the idea of this tiny little G. I'm going to call it a G unit. <laughs> and 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 I'll be honest, I think you're all going to be fine with that. The idea that we're building the G unit is great. We'll put it here on the banks of the river. We will give it a nice little road. And we will tell the grand people to come and build it. And they will. And they will. How's the dock doing? <sighs> oh, wow. That's done. Awesome. So this is done already. Um, which means we could do with getting some lorries to start drifting, drafting things over. Maybe what I should do is build a, an, our own little distribution office here. I'll set that in motion and then we'll finish up for this episode. Because it has been quite a long one. Um, hasn't it, folks? We don't need a big distribution office. It needs to be bigger than four, though. Eight vehicles, 15. 15 is pretty huge. Even even the, the eight vehicle one is pretty big. Can I fit it in this guy? Oh, why? Oh, this, no way. Oh, that's irritating. I made this lovely little path and it can't even come. What if I make two lots of eight? Two lots of four should do it, right? We build one, two. This should do it, right? You hear me? You've heard it here first, people. One, two. Right, so we'll get the bad boys coming and building that as well. Cool, 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 cool. Well, there you have it then. Dreori East has people. 
It has people. It has these things now working, gradually making chemicals. What, I'm going to... Chemicals? No. No, not chemicals. Gradually making... Stop purchasing things. I, I don't want you to do that. Thank you. Clear. Thank you. Gradually making some uh, crops. That's what's happening here. Gradually. Not much. I feel like this is using more crops. Yeah. I may be underestimated how slow the greenhouses are. Maybe. How fast is it pumping out chemicals? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's um, slow in it. Slow going. What's happening? Are people making food? We've got a little bit of food. Not a lot. It isn't a lot, is it? Maybe I thought this was going to be the big, the, the be all and end all of making food production, but perhaps, perhaps it's a little bit slow, which would make sense. It wouldn't be the fastest thing in the world, would it? Maybe I could edit it. <laughs> That's cheating. That is cheating. But I do think as we now turn to autumn, we do need to start thinking. Huh. Maybe next year we need more food production. But heating is working. Let's just get a quick overview of the facts and figures of thing. Everyone here has power. Everyone is heated. Which, that's decent. Everyone is... We've got some stuff that's been better. Oh my god! There's literally a percentage thing here to... Oh my god. Bloody God. How many times have I said, oh, it would be great to see, percentage-wise, how close this was to being completed? Bloody hell. I'm an idiot, man. Absolute idiot. Love it. Love this game. Best game in the world. Got a few unemployed people, but hopefully that should even out. Especially when we... We got people make... Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Interesting. Okay, so this is the pla the electronic components factory, and it seems to be doing a grand job of making components. Good for them. It means we'll be able to properly get some stuff built up here soon, and you are wonderful. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, listen, I think things are coming together here in... Oh, that helicopter shadow scared me. Things are coming together here in... Dreori, finally. It took a while, but we got there eventually. Um, we need more nonsense. We need more, more things. What's that? What? Kiri Rush is over here. That's because there's no one who lives there. That's fine. Come on, let's let's look. It, it's completed. Finally completed. This was a long episode, I know. But I'm really chuffed with how it looks. Next episode, then. I'm going to have a think about how food production works down here, but the next episode, I'm not bothered about down here. Now we've got all this working, we're going to leave it for a little while, and we are going to spend some time planning the cultural city. That is what we're going to do next session. We need to start planning it out. I know it's going to take a while. The bridge is barely even... It's not even across the water yet, but we're going to start. We're going to talk about the, the highway going to the NATO nations. That's where we're going to be. But until then, give me your thoughts on the new area. Give me ideas on what we can do uh, next for the cultural city and ideas for food production, that type of thing. I mean, we could just add a million greenhouses, but that, I think, would be stupid. Right. Until next time, then, friends. Uh, I hope that you have yourselves a lovely little week. Stay safe out there. And from all of us here in Fjordland. Bye-bye for now.